Hey everybody, Will Tompkins here at uh, Tom Cruise Studios, live music in Austin, bringing you episode number seven of Three Beers and Whiskey, featuring an interview with the Soapboxers. Here is the whiskey and beer number three. So I think we got whiskeys on there coming this way. I'd like to take this opportunity <laughs> oh to pass this special treat oh, on to you. Oh, well, shit. Yeah. You know, that went from, it was, oh, it was just a double when we started, but the ice went in and that is... It looks Guys, like we're gonna be drinking a the lot of whiskey. Fuck, that's whiskey, y'all. Oh, yeah. right? We got Kool Aid sitting outside. We're like, that's a double yeah. on whiskey. I think it's Kool Aid. Yeah, okay, Kool Aid. I bet it's drink cool is what I thought. Oh, bitch, it is. All right, cheers, guys. Hey, cheers. Cheers. Oh yeah. Cheers, y'all. All right. Everyone's a winner. Let's get over here. Yeah, you have to look each other in the eyes, right? Oh. That's the stuff. My father that is never make eye contact. Thank you to Chuck. Your father. All right, Chuck. Uh, Chuck for uh, Chuck. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I'm like uh, yeah. and <sighs> nicest guys. Like, hey, I'm gonna come over, watch the show, be in the studio audience. Cool, thank you. yeah, Chuck. He's like, I got some whiskey. I'll bring him. Like, okay. So um, yeah. And then Chuck goes, hey, I wanna, can I get some of that whiskey? And he looks at the the bottles. All you know, mm -hmm. there's maybe one shot left. So poor Chuck. Donate some whiskey to us for the show and barely gets his own out of it. So oh, thank you, Chuck. Yeah. Thanks, thank Chuck. You. Thank you. So, yes. You yeah. know, I would be remiss uh, if I didn't mention Garden Party, which is another project I've been doing. Be remiss. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be remiss. Uh, Wes, why so would you be project. remiss? Don't remiss yeah. him. Don't Good work. This isn't yeah. that kind of show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the upset. Um, <laughs> where's my mom? Yeah. Sorry. I did some recording today with Garden Party. That's going to be really cool. Very cool. Oh, yeah. uh, I haven't nice. even heard of this. What is it? Yeah, story? Oh, I was gonna say. Go ahead and light this. Talk about yeah, garden party a little bit. I mean, it, which? Well, I actually work at a school, a uh, music school called Bay State School of Music. So just Kelly. So Kelly's just in the audience over there. And so some of the teachers you can tell me. All right, are starting a project together called Garden Party. It's gonna be pretty cool. Very cool. Awesome. Stay. Look, look out for that. All right. right. Band Aid, very talented school. If you wanna send your kids. Uh, yes. What is it called again? I'm sorry. Called Band Aid School of Music. Band aid, yeah. school music, all ages, kids and adults. I have a few adult students. All right, good. And okay, and let's go ahead. Where can the internet? What's yeah. you got a web address? Uh, yeah, I mean, page. I think it's just bandaidschoolmusic.com. Yeah. All right. Yep. The, the crowd is like yes. Yeah. All right. Um. Yeah. And on kid, on your Sunday thing, you're getting ready to do. Do y'all have anything set up like a name or a web page or anything you want to promote beyond that? <laughs> No, no. I mean, I got back from Utopia Fest and got a text. Yeah. From, I got I got a text from Katie, and she's like, "Hey, you know, I miss playing with you gals. Do you wanna do something?" This is the and, early stages um, of something. So that's kind. Of, it's the early, early, early stages of like. But I, Great. I know we can fucking do it. Cause we've hey, done it before. There you go. All right. You know. Um, yeah. So we got like a little side project. Notes from uh, the two of you guys down here. What about you three guys? I mean, this is just uh, so boxers is your your ride and die, live well, and breathe it. No, I'm glad you caught that ridiculous reference. I think between the three of us, we could do something. Yeah, we're calling. Oh, no, no, y'all don't have to. No, 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 I, I could. Yeah, until so Tom, your, until Radiohead calls me, I'm playing with the song. All right, there you oh, go. Why are you ride or die? Oh, yeah. Call me Tom. Call me Tom. Um, <laughs> call me Tom. I, uh, <laughs> call me Tom. I have to ask you about this. So you sent me when, right before the album, I want to say it was before the album was released, you sent me like, hey, do you mind like listening to us and doing a review and tell me what you think? Um... And, and I was like, <laughs> I'll put you on man, spot for this one. Um, and I, I normally, you know, my thing is I'll go out to the shows, I'll take photos of the bands, and I'll write a review of the live performance. And it's not the live performance of the band, it's the live performance as perceived by the crowd. Because I don't play an instrument, I don't sing, so I have no ground to talk about, like, they did this or that or that. I'm like... Who the fuck am I? So I'd rather talk about the vibe in the crowd and what everybody, how they enjoyed it, or people were like on their phones and just kind of like, oh yeah, that's aperitif music or whatever. Um, so you send that to me and I was like, oh man, he's putting me on the fucking spot. And <laughs> uh, this shit. And just put my you know, I mean, I can do it. And so I listened to it, listened to it, listened. I really loved the album. 
Thank you. And I was like, yeah, that, and that, by the way, that was South First. Somebody's hauling ass down South First. So if you heard that, that was a car Sirens blasting down South First. I hope they're going to be okay. I don't care. <laughs> We're all in here, so they cannot be okay because we are all right. Um, but I wrote the review and sent it over to you. And and I read it and I was like I really liked it and I thought man I don't know if he's gonna get my tongue in cheek sense of humor some of the stuff I said and it, overall it's a badass review because it was a really good album um, and then and Marissa knows this later I was all like well I guess he didn't like it because he never posted anything about it and reposted <laughs> it and didn't I was like well. Yeah. I guess I was a little too colorful with some of the shit I said. Oh, I uh, do you remember the review? I, I remember some of it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I made some, and you know, here's the thing is, whether I'm writing a review about um, a band's performance, their live performance, I really, really try to stay away from making comparisons. I don't want to say they sound like or it was like this because that's what I heard and that's what I experienced. And somebody standing next to me goes, what the hell are you talking about? Which has happened to me before. I'm like, ooh, don't they sound like? And the guy next to me was like, uh, no. Yeah. So I learned my lesson really quickly on it's like stay away from the comparisons. But on your album, I was like, with you, because you have this really cool ability when you're singing, you can pitch this falsetto and then you have, you know, a different range that you sing. You have, depending on the song, you have these. And I listened to that. And I was like, "Wow, oh, man!" And I remember, I was like, "This is like Tom Jones. This is like the '70s." Yeah. 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 yeah, and yeah, and then of course, uh, it was, I was like, blush. "Hey, ladies, <laughs> that's awesome." <laughs> oh. Yeah. So I just remember like writing that, and it was all. Uh, you were like, hey, thanks. Oh, so I go right from you. No, no, it was I, beer. I reserve all my emotions. Yeah, it was my beer. It was, yeah, beer. So it was all fist in behind the beard. <laughs> yeah, and, and the guy that style. told you you were wrong for comparing bands, screw that guy. He's wrong. You're mm. right. Yeah, forget that. Guy. Now, well, you know, no, it, I, I actually, I really do agree with that because okay. Michael Diller. Awesome. Is awesome dude yeah. at Lucy's Retired Surfers Bar. Oh, oh and cool. I'm yeah, literally, absolutely. I was standing next to someone who's like, oh, holy shit, this is so awesome. And the guy was like, mm, that doesn't sound like that at all. I was all, uh, oh, and Jess and the Echoes were playing. Yeah. And, oh, yeah. and that's where part of the comparison came. We're like, oh, she sounds like, and they sound like this. And the guy was like, no. And he threw out a name of another, like a country band that she sounded like. I was all, what's so it was it was at that point I was like I really need to keep the comparisons away. I just need to talk right. about the true vibe in the crowd. Everybody really enjoyed it. They were singing along. They didn't know anything about the band afterwards. They're asking, "Who are these guys? Who's this band?" And so that's kind of when I learned I need to just let's keep it with what everybody's feeling and at the moment. Ma'am, how are you doing? So I have a question. Uh, so before I ask the question. Uh, who would want? Who would like to answer this question? That depends. Oh, it's, it's like old people diapers. Question. Question. I, 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 I say it. I say Lane. Okay. Oh, Lane. 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 Do you ever have a disagreements or disagreements with the band, and how do you handle it? Yes, all the time. <laughs> ah, all the time. I'm so Jeff, Jeff and I have been in the <laughs> since we were 12. We have arguments all the time. Um, here's how, you, how, how I'll tell you um, not to do it, passive aggressively. And that's yeah, how we do the it best more often. Kind. <laughs> that's the way that we do it. Don't do it like that. Typically, us. we do it passive aggressively, and it doesn't, nobody gets what they want. But how, how do we argue for real? Because I feel like uh, we do argue, and that's part of music is is disagreeing and compromise and figuring things out together. But I, I think I think as long as you you know you have the same goal in mind, it's it's okay. It's when people are, are trying to get at different things that's when you're I, you know, that's when you're split. Yeah, you I just think I feel sound like silliness. such a yeah, load of so shit. Politically <laughs> correct answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, 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 HR. Man. Okay, all right. That's, a, that's fair. That's you fair. can't do anything right. That's fair. That's fair. Because I started thinking about the real answer. Like, ah, let's just make something up. I don't know. I we, yeah, we fight. We do whatever. But I, I think I think when you love people, like it, it's okay to. Uh, uh, I mean, to disagree. To disagree God, all the disagree. time. I mean, yeah, we do. To be your we own will. individual person. I. Um, 
Jeff, we, we say shitty things to each other all the time. Like a utilitarian. <laughs> We, we do disagree, and, and I mean, Jeff, like, they're, they're especially, I think, the most important disagreements are the musical choices, right? We actually, like, really... You know, like, covering ABBA? Yeah, like, covering yeah. ABBA. Yeah. Like, I, was gonna I, say, I, I love ABBA. I don't like ABBA. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Where the <laughs> hell did that come from? I don't like ABBA. Is it okay ABBA. that I uh, see Waterloo? He's been resentful. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't like Abba. Oh, okay. Do I? Bad. We're gonna keep that. So then, I'm who's sorry, the dancing yeah. queen? There's a lot of good things that came out of Sweden. I don't think Abba was one. <laughs> Ghost. <laughs> this is. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. Got her so. got hey, bring her. one now. Bring She's one now. Let's let's shame, shame her. her. We did shame her. <laughs> no, no, no. She is not now with the red label of what we're drinking. Listen, I'm not ashamed of myself, and that's really truly oh, nice. Yeah. And I want you oh, all on the internet yeah, to know that you should notice. believe in yourselves. You and do, don't let girl. these don't yeah, let these guys or girl. any guys or anyone else. Oh, see that tell you doesn't that you look like just the same drink whatever beer you want to drink because some oh, beers oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. make you feel flushed. Oh, flushed. Oh, oh, it's fine. Yeah. All right. Third beer, peoples. Oh, we got the whiskey, right. third beer. Oh, 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 Alright, yeah. oh, oh, yeah. oh, here we And we got anything coming off the internet? Oh, oh shit. So while we're doing whiskey, we're doing beer, what do we got on the internet? So how do you write songs? Like what with a pen what, and paper. How oh, do great. how do you come up with your Falcon I think that's a really good question. Uh, because oh, Jeff and I go Jeff has written most of these songs himself, so that I don't I think what we're doing now is a lot different than the bulk of our set. Do you want to talk to maybe how most of the songs are written? Cause I don't know. I, I try to mix it up, you know, sometimes. See, I have a question about that, okay. about the songs. Okay. I mean, that's, that's a great question. She has it, it makes me lean to something. It was like, there's a lot of songs, as I listen, that are women's names or, <laughs> oh, or uh, wow. like that's, 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 that's all like influence on my life <laughs> what <laughs> women have had a profound influence yes they have in all of us yes. but but for you yes. it seems musically there is a a definitive thread that runs through that it's what like, else uh, is there you know, okay you well you know the gym. Do you hear that? Well, all right, all right. She said you gave me a different answer one time. Yeah, he told me once that because I was asking the same question. He's like, he's like, well, yeah. I mean, sometimes I'm talking about something totally else, and you know, I'll just call it a woman's name, but it's not really about a woman. It's about an experience, or it's about a situation. That is pretty. See, that's an epic, badass answer because that makes anybody that either buys your music or has it to go back and listen to it and go, yeah. wait, okay, wait, is he really talking about a woman? I, I some, some of them are about women, too, for sure, actually, but some of them are fun and cool. cool. Yeah. That's, that's, I like that answer, and I'm, you know, so we'll stick, that's that's his story, and he's sticking to it. That's why. That's why. He did say that. Well, and it resonated with me, too, because like, I've written songs for a long time as well, and I do that every once in a while, too, but... Yeah, yeah. It, Wait, you write songs about women every once in a while? Uh, every once in a while, Okay. Sure. Sometimes. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes, yeah. Okay. Women cool. exist, too. Yeah. <sighs> no, we wouldn't all exist. 50% of the time. Go, you bitch. Um, I do want to say... Anyway. Thank you guys very much for joining us tonight. Thanks for having me. Thanks for having me. That was, that was, there's some full ass third beer. I'm working on it. Clothes on his shoe. Okay. So, anyway, drink it. Everybody out there in internet land, on YouTube, on Facebook, thank y'all very much for joining us for Three Beers and Whiskey. Um, we appreciate y'all hanging out. We give lots of props and thanks to the Soapboxers. Go online, uh, webpage, Facebook. Soapboxersmusic.com. Soapboxersmusic.com. Oh, That's the right. Soapboxers. Oh, the. Oh, the. Uh, the Soapboxersmusic.com. Soapboxers.com. Get a better uh, No, it's not like uh, three beers and a whiskey. Yeah. Is that what you bought? Yeah, that's what I bought. No, no, no. It's the, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> We I don't have to regret hey, our choice. Okay, whatever. No, no, no. I like it. It's okay, whatever. Just type it all out. You'd fall asleep before you get to the end of it. So, thanks, monster. Um, <laughs> thanks, yeah, monster. Red Bull and vodka. Uh, so, uh, Gucci. <laughs>
<laughs> See, this is what happens at the end of beer and whiskey. It's yeah, like, get him oh, some more beer. What, <laughs> what is everybody <laughs> talking about? Jamie, um, take this roll. You know what, Jamie? Jamie, 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 I do want to thank everybody that showed up tonight. We, we do have a studio audience that is in here, so thank you all very much. Guys. Uh, we're going to go ahead and cut camera Same now. Day. Um, for everybody that is watching, y'all can go ahead and take your pee break. You can get yourself a fresh beer, a fresh whiskey. We are going to come back in about 10, 15 minutes, and the soapboxers are going to go ahead and do some uh, a little bit of exactly. music for it. Somehow. We <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> All right, thank you very much for tuning in for that interview with the Soapboxers. Make sure you come back, look for the video with the performance, the after the interview performance of the Soapboxers.